Well, Ubibred really has achieved a lot. It was a huge collaboration to solve the problem of patients with severe asthma, the most severe cases who are really suffering from asthma that is not uh, being treated well at the moment. We went back to the drawing board of a disease, severe asthma, that at present is not well treated. We can't treat it, but we went down to the real biology, down into the lung and into the systems of individual patients. And that brought up you know, new ideas and new mechanisms that the industry can really use for targeting new drugs. It really transformed the severe asthma field because we are now recognizing that patients are not alike. Individual patients have their individual abnormalities. Some have uh, cells that are abnormal of a certain type and other patients have other cells that are abnormal with their molecular uh, pathophysiology. So the, the patient is taking seriously in her or his individual condition and that brings individual treatment much closer to the clinic. So that, that is the real benefit for the patients, uh, I think, directly. The patients have been extremely important in the project. Right from the beginning, we had patients, advisory boards, but also individual patients at each level of governance of the project. And it really helped us so much because they really questioned you know, our, our directions in relation to the, their own worries. And our patients have uh, written a booklet and published it on the internet, how to involve patients and let have them participate in today's clinical research. And really is, I think, a guide for translational research, having the patients really at each step involved. And I, I, it was a really a, a tremendously uh, nice experience to work with patients so closely. Well, the, the severe asthma research field was really trying its best on a fragmented scale. You, see, you know, everyone was trying to solve the problem. But IMI brought us all together, the industries, the, the academics, the clinical research and the research in, in basic research on, on tissues and, and, and cells. And that has made the difference. And, and particularly the industries working together with the academics and let's not forget the industries working together because they, there was you know kind of rivalry between them but by putting them around the same question I think we, that really made the difference and that's why Ubibret has made real step changes that would not have occurred without uh, IMI. IMI has really changed the medical uh, research field by combining the academic and the industrial research power for the same deep questions of underlying disease mechanisms. And I think uh, this is the, the way forward because uh, all the intellectual research power now is being focused for the same purpose. And I think Europe has really taken the lead here because all the industries are, who are working all around the world and academics who collaborate occasionally are now around the same table. This would not have been possible without the support of IMI. It really brought us all around the same table for the same purpose. And I think this is the novel way of doing research. We can't do without it anymore.